What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another tech tip. I hope you all had a great Thanksgiving, but in today's video, I'm going to show you how to change your homepage in Microsoft Edge. Check it out. So before we go on actually over to the computer here, I just wanted to kind of briefly explain what we're going to do real quick is we're actually going to look at the two different icons for Internet Explorer and Microsoft Edge. We do know with the upgrade or the uh, introduction of Windows 10, Microsoft Edge has replaced Internet Explorer. So if you are still using Internet Explorer, we recommend you stop in choosing either Firefox, Chrome, or Microsoft Edge because Internet Explorer is a very unsafe browser to use and it can cause a whole lot of problems if you get something on the system. So at the computer now, we've got two, two icons down here in the bottom left hand corner as you can see. The Internet Explorer icon was the blue E with the halo around it which has been uh, surpassed by Microsoft Edge which is just the little blue E itself. So if you don't have it down there on the taskbar, you can always hit your Windows key and then just type in Edge and you'll notice Microsoft Edge will pop up in the start menu. Go ahead and left click on that. That's going to open up to typically an MSN page. You may get a prompt saying if you wanted to have it as your default browser. If you do want it as your default browser, go ahead and click yes. Otherwise, you can click on don't ask me again. That will show up at the bottom. I already have my Chrome as my default browser, so I didn't get that. Um, but what we're going to want to do mainly is pay attention to the top right hand corner. Left click on the three little dots and then come on down to the very bottom and left click on settings. Once you have clicked on settings, this menu will appear right here. What we're going to want to pay attention to is open Microsoft Edge with. There's four different options in here. The start page, which is to your typical MSN page. It has a rundown of some news, some weather, etc. on there. You can do a new tab page where when you open up Microsoft, a, uh, Microsoft Edge, that it will just open up a blank tab and you can go wherever you want to. Uh, previous pages, if you've had some uh, previous websites open in the past, you can actually have it resume on those as well. And then a specific page or pages is what we're going to focus on today. We're going to left click that as the option. And we're just going to type in www.google.com. And then you're going to want to click on the little floppy disk to the right. And that will actually save that as the home page. Now you can make it to where it will open up multiple pages as your home page. What you can do is you can click add a new page. Say you wanted to do www.yahoo.com as a secondary home page. You can type that in and left or save it on the floppy disk as well. And then what we're going to want to do, of course, is actually test it and make sure that it's working the way that it should. So to do that, exit out of Edge completely. Come on down and reopen up Edge. And you'll notice up here at the top, not only Google, but Yahoo also loaded as well. Hey guys, thanks for watching that tech tip video. Hope you learned something today. If you haven't already done so, go down, hit the subscribe button, leave any kind of comment or feedback in the comment section below the video. Like the video, share the video, and just a quick question of the day before you go, what type of browser do you use? Again, leave that information below the video and we will see you next time.